<laughs> busy, busy daytime. Uh, it was a huge, huge decision, 5-4, uh, by the United States Supreme Court. Uh, and joining us right now to answer that question and others uh, is Valerie Jarrett, Senior Advisor to President Barack Obama. Uh, Valerie, good morning. Good morning, Roland. Good morning, Tom. How are you all doing? I'm doing, doing good. Great. Uh, doing great. First thing that first thing that jumps out uh, in it, uh, the president uh, and the White House uh, was clear that uh, this was not a tax. But uh, Chief Justice John Roberts, uh, that's how he framed it. And frankly, without calling the uh, uh, the health care bill, looking at it as a, t- a tax versus through the Commerce Clause, that's how this thing was upheld. So. I'm sure you guys are happy that uh, the Chief Justice it framed it any that way. way we get it. I mean, we <laughs> argued both ways. We thought that it fell within the Commerce Clause. The court ruled that it, uh, it was um, a tax. We really look at it as a penalty. Uh, but whatever they want to call it, the fact of the matter is it was a historic day for the United States. A country as wealthy as ours is now going to provide health insurance for everyone. Now, now, when we talk about now, so what does it what does it actually mean? But we know some provisions have already been put in place. But most of the Affordable Care Act 